Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. Today in this video, we are going to take up one radical rational expression for simplification. Expression is square root of square root 10 minus 3 plus square root of square root 10 plus 3 over square root of square root 10 plus 1. I will simplify this question in two different ways. Let me write here method number 1. Let me call this expression equal to e. And now I will use method of rationalization. So I will consider the rationalization with denominator. So I need to multiply numerator and denominator with denominators conjugate. So it would be square root 10 minus 1 like this. And I will multiply with the same in the numerator also. Now I will call numerator n this term. And denominator I will consider the product of these two square roots. So let me write in this manner. This is our numerator and denominator respectively. Now I will simplify numerator separately and denominator separately. So let me write here denominator first. So d will be equal to square root of square root 10 plus 1 times square root of square root 10 minus 1. Now we are having square roots in both the terms so I will club all together. I will write square root 10 plus 1 times square root 10 minus 1. Now we can use one algebraic identity difference of two squares. We know it is a plus b times a minus b equal to a square minus b square. So here I can apply a plus b times a minus b. So what I will be writing after that it would be square root of under the root 10 square minus 1 square. So square root and square will be over. So I will write square root of 10 minus 1 which is equal to square root of 9. Now we know that 9 is 3 square. Now square root of 3 square. Now square and square root will be over. 3 will be our denominator value. So denominator is resolved. Now we will consider our numerator. So let us consider numerator. I will write numerator equal to so I will be writing square root of square root 10 minus 1 times square root of square root 10 minus 3 plus square root of square root 10 plus 3. Bracket close. This is our numerator. Now we have to simplify. I will take multiplication. So it will become square root of square root 10 minus 1 times square root of square root 10 minus 3 plus square root of square root 10 minus 1 times square root of square root 10 plus 3. Now same way I will consider one common square root and inside I will write square root 10 minus 1 as exponents are same. Bases are different, so we can consider multiplication in base. So I will write root 10 minus 3 plus square root of square root 10 minus 1 times square root 10 plus 3. Let's take the product. So I will write square root of root 10 times root 10, 10 minus 1 times minus 3, 3. Now cross multiplication. Minus 1 times root 10, minus root 10, minus 3 times root 10, minus 3 root 10. So minus 4 root 10 plus square root of square root 10 times square root 10, 10, minus 1 times plus 3, minus 3. Then cross multiplication, 3 times root 10, 3 root 10, minus 1 times root 10, minus 1 root 10. 3 minus 1 is 2, 
so I will write 2 square root 10. Now, square root, it would be 13 minus 4 root 10. And here we can write it is 7 plus 2 root 10. Now, how we can find out this is square root? So, I can see 13 can be split in this manner. I can write 8 plus 5, 13 minus 4 root 10. Here I will split 7 as 5 plus 2. So, I will write 5 plus 2 plus 2 times root 10. Now, I will make this radicant one perfect square. How it is? See, we can write this is the square root 8 whole square plus square root 5 whole square plus or but this sign is minus so I will write 2 times if I will write this one then it would be square root 8 times square root 5. Second square root I will write square root of square root 5 square plus square root 2 square plus 2 times square root 5 times square root 2. You can see it is written. This term also 2 times square root 8 is 2 root 2. So, it is 4 root 2. 4 root 2 times root 5, it is 4 root 10. So, what I will write here now, this first radicant is square root of, this term I will write square root 8 minus square root 5 whole square. And here I will be writing plus square root of square root 5 plus square root 2 whole square. Now you can cancel square root and square. So numerator calculation is coming out. Square root 8 minus square root 5 plus square root 5 plus square root 2. Now plus root 5 minus root 5 will be over. It is left square root 8 plus square root 2 as numerator. So, I can write this expression E equal to numerator is square root 8 plus square root 2 divided by denominator was 3. Now, I can write square root 8 as square root 2 times 4. So, it is 2 root 2 plus root 2 divided by 3 or I can write 3 root 2 divided by 3. So, answer will become root 2. Root 2 is our final answer. Now, method number 2. This time I will rationalize our numerator and denominator with respect to numerator. Let me write here E equal to I will multiply my numerator, see, root 10 minus 3 plus square root, square root 10 plus 3. This is our numerator. Now, I will multiply with its conjugate. So, I will be writing square root, square root 10 minus 3 minus square root, square root 10 plus 3. And in denominator also. So, I will be writing square root of square root 10 plus 1 and then this bracket. I will write square root 10 minus 3 and then minus square root of square root 10 plus 3. Same way, we will simplify this time denominator. Numerator will be the difference of two squares. You can see this is a plus b, a minus b. So, what I will write in the numerator? It will become a square. So, I will be writing root 10 minus 3. A square and square root will be over minus b square. So, I will write here square root 10 plus 3 divided by square root of square root 10 plus 1 and the same bracket, the conjugate bracket square root square root 10 minus 3 minus square root square root 10 
plus 3. Now I will cancel square root and minus square root 10. So numerator will become minus 3 minus 3 minus 6 over. So let me write here minus 6 over square root square root 10 plus 1 and then numerators bracket I will write square root of square root 10 minus 3 minus square root of square root 10 plus 3. Same way I will expand my denominator this time. So I will write few steps directly. So once I will expand first bracket so I will be writing straight away root 10 times root 10, 10, 1 times minus 3, minus 3. Then it is minus 3 root 10 plus 1 root 10. So minus 2 root 10. And then minus sign. Again we will be writing square root. Root 10 times root 10, 10. 1 times 3, 3. 3 times root 10, 1 times root 10, 4 times root 10. Now I will write minus 6 over square root 7 minus 2 root 10. This is first radicand minus square root 13 plus 4 root 10. Same way I will split my numerator. See I will write here minus 6 as it is no change. Now I will split the denominators radicand term 7. How it is? I will write this is square root 5 whole square plus square root 2 whole square. Now it is minus 2 times square root 5 times square root 2. Same way. Minus square root of. Now 13 I will see as 8 plus 5. So I will write square root 8 whole square plus square root 5 whole square. This is 13. Now 2ab. So 2 times square root 8 which is 2 root 2 times b value is 5 square root 5. So 2 times 2 root 2 4 root 2 times root 5. So it is 4 root 10 which is matching with this. So we can replace directly. We can write minus 6 over this is which is square root 5 minus root 2. Done. Now second one is whole square of root 8 plus root 5. So square and square root will be over. Now we will cancel root 5 and root 5 with plus and minus sign. Now you can see what is left minus 6 in the numerator. So I will write here minus 6 divided by minus root 2 and see what is left minus root 8. So I will write minus roots minus 6 over minus root 2 and minus 2 root 2. Root 8 is, see it is 2 root 2. So I will write 2 root 2. So denominator becomes 6 over 3 root. 2 root 2 plus root 2. Minus minus will be cancelled out. So what is left? 2 over root 2. Now I can write 2 as root 2 times root 2. Denominator is root 2. 1 root 2 we can cancel. So our ultimate answer using rationalization of numerator also it is matching with the correct answer root 2. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching friends. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself.